ladies and gentlemen, what's going on? Welcome back to another episode of Fantasy Life. Last time, we started the angling life, and uh, we are now on the way to catch, or to find out about catching an apple fish. I'm going to uh, speak to Fisherman Sage here, who may know a thing or two. You're back already, how did it go? Huh, oh, that. What's wrong, you didn't catch anything? No, that's not it, we got a Castel Crucian, that was a piece of cake, this kid's not bad. The reason we're looking kind of down is because this old man we met. He came all the way here from Port Puerto to buy an apple fish, but they didn't have any on the market, and we felt really sorry for him. He seemed to be looking forward to some grilled apple fish so much. As an angler, I'd feel really bad if I didn't do anything to help him out. Apple fish, you say? I see. Apple fish are very hard to come by these days. I've heard no reported sightings from anglers recently. Grandpa, is there nothing I can do? Calm down and let me finish, Isaac. Anglers are always stay. Anglers must always stay cool-headed. You see, even we, if we anglers are clueless, they may be another group you can ask. Fish are a matter of life and death for them. They're even crazy about fish than us anglers. Ah, you're talking about the cats, right, Grandpa? Yes, indeed. If anyone knows where to find applefish, it's cats. Thanks, Grandpa. I'd be off to look for a cat then. Okay. Isaac left your party. Coo. Also, I whistled there. That may have probably peeked out the microphone. That was bad. One impatient young angler. What about you? Do you also want to look for an applefish? Yeah, all right, I suppose. No need to be coy about it. You, too, could ask the town cats about the good spots for applefish, you know. If you do manage to reel one in, that'd be proof enough for me that you're a born angler. Let's think of it as a competition between you and Isaac. I wonder who will get that fish first. Dum -da -da -dum -dum -dum. See the cat in the town square. Oh, the one on the, the roof? Like, right near the entrance to the... Artisans district? I should, I don't know, maybe, potentially, we'll have a look. But, oh boy, I can't believe we're starting another life, that's insane. And I think this is our eighth life out of twelve, which is awesome! And this is mostly, like, a uh, skill-based as well, which means we can probably do this easily, rather than the stupid ones where you just make stuff. Or... This fish is called trout. What's that? Apple fish? I don't know where to look for them. But it'd take a long time to explain in feline ease. So I guess I'll just talk. I know where to look for applefish, but my wisdom isn't free, human. You have to pay me in tuna, delicious tuna. You look desperate, like a cat about to fall into water. And you're just a novice. Okay, I'll help you for free this time. I'm a generous cat. But I'll milk you once you become a skilled angler. You'll find cats offering advice on fishing all around Riveria. Come on, I'll show you the fishing spot. Follow me out. That's... <laughs> As you could guess from their name, applefish prefer water near apple trees. I know exactly where this is going to be. It's going to be in the south, like, just where we've been, yeah. Where the big old apple tree is, which we can't even get apples from. Okay, well, let's go there. Let's find it. Oh yeah, look at that. It's going to be pointing in the, the water by the big apple tree on the right over here. Oh, who would have guessed it, huh? Up here, by the big apple tree. No way. <laughs> oh, oh no. Who never would have guessed it? Meow then. See this fish silhouette? I have a feeling in my whiskers that you'll make a fine angler. I'll be watching over you. Uh, talk to me if the fish all swim away. Watch your line gauge. As your line gauge will rise if you pull on your rod with a fishing line. Keep pulling when the line gauge is full and the line will snap. Yikes. Uh, sometimes fish will fight. Stop pulling for a second and relax your rod in the direction the fish is struggling. Okay. Uh, to prevent the line gauge filling up, watch the on-screen arrow. Relax your rod. Okay. If the line gauge is uh, perilously full, feel free to stop pulling for a while, as long as the fish isn't struggling. This will allow your line gauge to gradually reduce. Okay. This sounds a little bit more complex than last time. So wait for the fish to bite. Then I strike. Go on, go on. Whoops. I'm a plonker. Oh wait, the fish is back. Aha! So it is a bit like Animal Crossing where he doesn't just bite first time. You have to wait for the, the sinker to go in. Believe it or not, to sink. Oh, it bobbed. Okay, now pull, 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 pull. Oh, this is easy. That was very easy. <laughs> And uh, we reeled in the tasty apple fish. Oh, please. That was the easiest thing I've ever done since apples or something. I don't know. Uh, it makes me hungry, but I'll let you have it. I trust you'll treat me next time. My job here is done. Okay. Well, hang on. Let, let's try that again. Can I not try that again? Oh, yes, I can. I just want to find a like a fish which I have to actually fight against, if that makes sense. 
Because I just yanked that one in and it worked. Okay. There we go. Um, okay, I'm going to let it... Okay, his health is gradually going up. Oh, okay, okay. Okay, okay, I got it. Ah, uh, okay, I'm following. I'm following. And that's a Castellcrucian. Ah, cool. Okay, I understand now. So when it starts struggling, just let go of A and start yanking in the direction it tells you to. Pretty self-explanatory, really. Oh, deliver the fish to the sea barrier at the end, not to the guy who I was just talking to. And who was the guy I was just talking to? Ah, uh, the fisherman sage, of course. Okay, in we go to the inn. Can I come into the out now? <laughs> oh. Oh dear. Hey, Seabury. How's it going? What's it said, Barry? Seabury, yeah. That, that fish. It's an apple fish. And look how big it is. I'm so grateful. Oh. Hand it over the apple fish. Give it back. Uh, it would be unseemly to take this from you without offering a reward. How about this? 500 dosh. Money! You said your name is Dale. I shall remember it. Thank you so much. Once you become an even more capable angler, come see me in Port Puerto. I go by the name of Seabury. You can usually find me in Port Puerto's. Sorry to keep you waiting. I got it. I got an apple fish, huh? What are you doing here, Dale? Ha ha. Sorry to keep you waiting. Ho ho ho. Who would have thought it? It seems like apple fish are biting today, eh? Wait, what? You mean Dale picked me to the post? Well, that's something you can tell people back home in Port Puerto about, mister. Ho ho, yes, I imagine the Anglers Association will be thrilled by the news of your apple fish catch. They'll all be glad to know the fisherman sage has got himself some good pupils. What? You know, Grandpa? Grandpa? Well, uh, the fisherman sage and I have been friends for a long time. We launched monthly catch magazine together. Ah, good memories. I've read every single issue of that magazine. I absolutely love the Port Puerto Special Reports. I now, kn now I know why you look so familiar. You're from the Anglers Association. Oh, I thought you knew it from the start. Yes, I'm Seabury, chairman of the Anglers Association. Isaac, I'd be happy to see you in Port Puerto too. I'd be thrilled to see the association. I've been dreaming about this. I'm glad to see you so excited. Come see me when you're in Port Puerto and I'll show you around. Holy crab sticks, that'd be amazing. Thank you so much, mister. We've got lots to tell Grandpa. Oh, yes, we do. And Isaac has joined our party, and this is where we finish the miss m mission. The mission. Finish the mission. Hey, and that's not bad, since we've only been going for ten minutes. Ah, uh, yeah. Alright, off to Grandpa. We go I'm going to call him Grandpa now, dang it. <laughs> hey, and I mean, I guess what I can do between this episode and the next is uh, craft all the fishing rods, similar to what I did with the swords. So I'll just make, like, one fishing rod for every level of fishing. And uh, just switch to them as I uh, as I need to, and because I'm such an amazing carpenter, I can make like the best ones possible. Ho ho! Okay, here we go, Grandpa. Oh, you met Seabury. I see, I see. Then word of your exploits will no doubt reach as far as Port Puerto. That means we've got to do something about your ranks. You can't just be novices. You've trained very well indeed. Let me have a look at your results. Fledgling fisherman. Ah, oh, yeah, that puts me up to an, an a novice. No, uh, uh the the. Uh, adept fledgling yeah <laughs> cool uh, you are fine anglers without a doubt from now on come and see me whenever you land a good catch and as Seabury no doubt told you head to Port Puerto once you've brushed up your, your angling skills don't just aim for Port Puerto though fish are awaiting you all over the world if you try you can catch fish in the most unlikely of places such as lava flows and even clouds and if you reel in a rare fish let me know and I'll put in a monthly catch for everyone to read about no whales, seriously? Of course, a long time ago I featured on the cover myself too. Well, actually it was because we had no budget and couldn't afford to use models. <laughs> It'd be awesome if I could make the cover too. I want to catch some jaw-droppingly good, amazing fish. I don't even know why I said good there. There was no good in that text. Also, I want to catch this fish right next to me. I want to know what fish I have to catch. This is... Oh, this is so exciting. <laughs> uh, why am I so excited about fish? I don't understand it. Uh, yes, I will save the game because I look awesome. I look badass. I mean, look at that hat. Whew. Okay. So, obviously, we're going to have to talk to people. Uh, do you want to do something? I want to chat. Young angler, explore Riviera and its fishing spots. Local cats will tell you what kind of fish can be found at various fishing spots. I suppose you could call it their feline intuition. If you seek knowledge, find the cats first. Oh, you got something else to say? Um, chat. 
My star pupil, it's time you embarked on a journey. A journey to find fish in all different lands of Riveria. As you go about fishing, you should meet new people and forge new friendships. I trust you know what stats are invaluable to us anglers, hmm? Those are focus, intelligence, and dexterity. Focus is the most important of them all. You do fine wherever you go. Keep that in mind. Farewell, fish well. Okay, Isaac, what do you want? Dale, you aren't half bad, huh? You know what? I'll treat you to some fish cuisine. My specialty. Can't fish on an empty stomach. Cool, thanks, buddy. I will never probably use that. Uh, what do you think is the most precious fish in all of Castel? The carasis, the carp, or maybe the applefish? Ha! Huh. All of those are way too common. A weathered angler would reply, it's the ornamental carp, of course. Now that's super rare and super valuable fish. It appears near a waterfall in West Castel. The scales are really pretty. Try to catch it if you pass by that waterfall. Alright. I don't know whereabouts that was. Meow, nice to see you little angler. Just like a lifeguard looks out for swimmers, we look out for aspiring anglers. We are Tobin Squad. Alice <laughs> Franklin, I am Trout, leader of operations. There are other cats in Port Puerto now at Magic 2, who are members of the Toe Bean Squad 2. We gather helpful information for anglers so that we can lend a paw when you're in too deep. Keep an eye out for us. Alright. Ah, little angler, I've been waiting for you. Do you know about the fish around here already? There's the Castel Crucian, the Castel Carp, and the Ornamental Carp. Together they make up Castel's royal platter of fish. Ah, oh, good to know. Let's take a look at our quests we can do. Um, okay. Five Castel Crucians, can we find waters? Ten, uh, Castel Carp, five, and the grassy plains. Um, and the, uh, the catch an apple fish. In the grassy plains as well. Wait, what? Catch an apple fish on the grassy plains. Okay. I'm gonna go to that waterfall and see if I can find that, uh, that, that, that thing. <laughs> the, the, uh, the other thing. South Castel. It appears you've got a new letter. Hmm, I wonder what that could be from. I'm pretty sure the waterfall... Oh, wait, hang on. I need SP for this, don't I? Pretty sure the waterfall they were talking about was this one, but I'm probably wrong. Oh, well, let's um, let's try and catch this fish anyway. I mean, I know there's more than one fish down here, but uh, I want to try and catch this one. Go on. Go on, take a bite. Nom, 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 nom. Okay, reel it in. Easy peasy. Boom. A giant Castel Crucian. Okay. Why was it giant? <laughs> that makes no sense to me. I want to find this waterfall in West Castell. I think it's over this way. Um, oh yeah, that would make sense. It would be where, like, um... Um... Wait, no, this is East Castell. Well, then where am I going? I'm going to West Castell. See you later. <laughs> I've got to find a waterfall somewhere. Uh, also, how long have we been going for? Hmm... Hmm, we've got a couple of minutes left, I think. Uh, let's see if we can go to where that fishing spot is and find something there to fish. Uh, West Castell, okay. So there's a waterfall um, up by the place where we had to do the Paladin quest. I think it was the Paladin quest. Was it up here? Yeah. Okay, how do I get to the waterfall? And is it at the top of the waterfall or the bottom of the waterfall? All I know is that there's a waterfall there. Um, and I can't get around to it unless it's back there. Oh, it might be back there. Dun 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 dun. dun. Okay, take a look. Aha! I see a fishy. Yeah, fishy, fishy, fishy. Wow, that was a good cast. Good job, me. Okay, ornamental carp, huh? Go on, take a bite. There we go. Oh, easy, easy, easy mode. Boom! That won't be an ornamental carp straight away. No. Okay, so it seems like there is going to be like a, some sort of rarity thing where you have to fish in the same spot multiple times in order to get the fish you desire. Okay. Let's just hope we can get a little bit luckier. Maybe that's why I'm getting these giant ones. Or maybe the reason I'm getting the giant ones is because I'm reading them in like straight away. Now, that was just a regular Crucian Carp. That's fine. My first catch complete. Even though it wasn't my first catch. But whatever. Wait, hang on. Are the giant Crucian Carps not count or Carps not counting towards uh, my total? That would kind of stink. Okay. Oh, this feels like a big one. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh. Okay. That does require concentration. Okay, come on, come on, big fishy, big fishy. Ornamental carp, boom, gotcha. Ha 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 ha. 
Awesome. We we already caught like one of the rare fish. That's kind of neat. I like that. That was fun. <laughs> I know it seems weird seeing like just saying that was fun, but that was. Um, oh, do I actually have to hand it into the sage? Cool. Do uh, you want to tell me something? Yes, I want to report because I caught an ornamental carp. Oh, that wasn't really that many skill points, I guess. Uh, okay, well, let's... Uh, <laughs> uh, I'm not a uh, higher rank already. Let's try and catch some fish over here. Let's see what they do. Boo, 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 boo. And catch you. Boom, up you get. Another crucian carp. Very nice. Let's try catching you, sir. See if you're anything special. I haven't found any of the uh, plain sweet fish yet. Okay, just spin around and up you come. Very nice. I guess all the crucians are going to be up here. Um, and the plain sweet fish will be somewhere else. Probably in the grassy plains, to be fair. <laughs> that would make most sense, wouldn't it? So maybe next episode we, we take our, our journeys to the grassy plains and we fish over there. Although I do have to get an apple fish too from the grassy plains. Okay, how many more Crucian Carps do I need to catch? Or Castell Crucians, even. Crucians? Cru cru Crucians? Cru Crucians. Um, 8 out of 10. Use counter hook. Press A the moment the fish swallows the lure. 10 times. Wow, okay. So I've got to be like really quick on the mark for that one. Jeez. How am I going to do that? Okay, focus dial. I think that was it, maybe? I, I don't know. Was was that counter hook? Um, I'm pretty sure I pressed A as soon as it did it. Press A the moment the fish swallows the lure. I, I could have sworn I did that. Did I not do that? Oh well, let's try one more catch here. That's very bizarre. How are you even meant to know? Like, I guess I could just look it above my head, the same as in Pokemon. Um, I don't know if I did it there or not. And another Crucian, so that's good. That means that will be the one, uh, the Crucian expert. Huh. How bizarre. Catch a Castell Cup, sometimes found walks around Castell. Hmm. Well, I mean, it looks like we're going to be going to the Grassy Plains next time. But yeah, that, that was a little bit bizarre. Anyway, thank you all very much for watching this episode of Fantasy Life. Next time, we will be heading into uh, the Grassy Plains to see about catching um, the... What's it called? The <laughs> we're, we're going to catch the what's it called. Thanks very much for watching, guys. And I, of course, will see you all in the next one. Ain't here but us... Ain't nothing here but us chickens. Dang it, I messed that one up.